Hi guys, uh, in this video I will show you how to record a great landing video in Microsoft Flight Simulator uh, which is similar to how you can record in uh, Explain. So uh, first you need a replay recording tool. Uh, there is a built-in uh, tool in uh, Flight Simulator but I don't use that. I use uh, Sky Dolly. So to get Sky Dolly, just go to Sky Dolly. Uh, you can download it from uh, uh, github directly so this is a tool for uh, recording uh, a replace in microsoft flight simulator so how to get a good landing First, uh, download Sky Dolly. Uh, you can go to the re releases here. Um, you can go to the releases and download the latest version. So you can uh, download the skydolly.zip file. So I already have skydolly.zip. All you have to do is uh, download it and extract it to uh, wherever you want it. So just click on the skydolly. Uh, zip file it will download automatically I am cancelling it because I already downloaded it now I have saved uh, sky dolly in uh, downloads flight simulator d colon so you can go to sky dolly dot uh, uh, exe in the sky dolly folder and uh, run sky dolly so you can see that the, this is the interface for sky dolly you can start record by pressing the record button so first uh, we will set up a landing in a Microsoft Flight Simulator. So launch a Flight Simulator if you are not already done. Go to the world map and choose any airport uh, of your liking. You can choose any airport in the world. I am choosing uh, Mumbai International Airport. Make sure you uh, select a runway with an ILS actually. So I am choosing runway 9 as a uh, arrival and uh, can choose the time and all that you can uh, if you choose live time the only problem is that uh, while uh, uh, displaying the replay you may not get the exact weather conditions that you uh, choose so I am just choosing a custom weather and custom time so now let us uh, put fly So this is an easy way to actually set up landings in uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator. Just choose the runway. Now, once you are re ready to fly, immediately press on the active pause button. You need to do a few setup first. So let us uh, start with the. Putting the lights, nav lights, strobe lights, uh, landing lights on, seat belt lights on. Now we need to enter the ILS frequency for Mumbai runway. It is not automatically uh, done. So go to tune, you need to tune nav 1. So to find out the ILS frequency of runway 9 in Mumbai, so I go to Google. So you can go to ILS uh, information, you need to get the frequency. So here you get the frequencies uh, for runway number 9 it is uh, 109.5. So 109.5 is the frequency for uh, uh, ILS runway 9. So we go to Microsoft Flight Simulator, put uh, 109.5 and uh, click on the nav1 uh, soft key here so we have tuned uh, the ILS frequency here click on nav and you can uh, automatically see localizer is getting displayed now click on uh, nav mode get the localizer uh, uh, tuned uh, click on autopilot 
autopilot should be on and also click on approach mode so once you do that uh, your landing is set up now you just need to increase the throttle just increase the throttle as uh, then uh, already the landing gear is uh, deployed so no problem so now we can come out of the active pause so we have set up uh, just make sure that uh, we are on the right glide path glide slope yes so you can see that we are slowly descending as per the glide slope and localizer is already tuned so we are on the correct uh, path to land you can see it's a glorious uh, early morning so after that now all we have to do is wait for the plane to get near the runway at this point you want to start recording in uh, sky dolly so you can record uh, start recording in sky dolly like that that will start recording the sequence keep an eye on the air speed and the glide slope here make minor adjustment to throttle just to make sure that you don't over speed or under speed i think 120 125 is the ideal speed for uh, landing or Cessna Citus CJ4 you can choose any aircraft you want i have chosen uh, Cessna Citus CJ4 can see the runway clearly here glorious morning landing at uh, mumbai international airport reaching 1000 altitude altitude you can choose to disconnect the autopilot whenever you want I'm getting a little uh, jerky here because of the scenery land in uh, pilot view cockpit view can disengage the autopilot whenever you want i will uh, disengage it uh, as we are slightly closer to the runway autopilot Just raise the nose slightly. So 
so we made the landing can slow down here so after that uh, once you have made the landing you can actually now uh, stop the replay stop recording the replay so now what uh, we can do is uh, we can just uh, go back now we can put restart here restart will again uh, get us back to the top of the uh, approach final approach so we'll uh, go back to the 10 uh, nautical mile approach yeah replace recorded here you can give a title mumbai landing give mumbai landing now uh, click on ready to fly and immediately double click on the replay in sky dolly it will start up uh, paused so the replay is paused here so now what we can do is we can actually go close to the runway here like this to start recording the replay we want only a small part of it so go to camera go to showcase mode and now i'll tell you an important thing now uh, just reset the position here you need to be exactly at the center so now click on drone lock mode and uh, disable drone follow mode immediately the reason is uh, only when the uh, camera centered on the plane the drone lock mode works properly otherwise uh, it doesn't now use the drone camera controls in your uh, xbox controller or uh, compatible controller and go, go to the end of the runway or go to a suitable point in the runway from where we want to start taking the replay so set the speed of the drone accordingly now reach the runway let us uh, say here we'll uh, set our position here somewhere here not exactly on the ground slightly above the ground so you can just adjust the camera as you please so now give a nice zoom so we can see the plane 100 zoom and now uh, close this camera view close all the other windows and now start uh, playing the replay at this point when if you want to record the replay you can actually do it in OBS or uh, similar uh, uh, screen recording software already I'm all recording so you can get the view and see how I'm landing here okay, and adjust the zoom level So that's it. Uh, you can uh, restart the landing as many times as you, as you wish uh, to record from different points of view. So I hope this uh, tutorial is useful to you. You can uh, use different camera views in uh, showcase mode to uh, view the landing again and again uh, or record it as you wish. So I hope this uh, tutorial was useful to you. If you like this, uh, please uh, like the video and please subscribe to my channel. Uh, thank you very much for watching this.